So I went to the doctor yesterday and she asked like, you know, if we were planning on having any more kids and I basically told her When she grows up, she's gonna be a great girl. Dad is at work. He works in the day now, so at night. So um, I have to set this thing up. I'm gonna set this up. So my arms are tired of stretching and stuff. So. We have to do it all right. I can't do that. And then after that, I, I can't feel him. I'll be back in a bar. Can I see? Let's set the timer. I only get to 100. Well, you can't do 100 minutes. Liam, I'm gonna set the timer, and when it goes off, it's gonna be Oliver's turn with the car. Well, I know you do, but that's just not how it works. All right, well then I'll let him play with it for forever. Okay, see, that's not fair, is it? Okay, so I'll set the timer for him. And then I'm gonna set, it'll be your turn and I'll set the timer for you. Liam, when it goes off, it's Oliver's turn. It's been a day. Um, this morning has not been the greatest as far as with them. <laughs> it's been kind of hectic. They're fighting a lot. And when you hear all that noise, at least for me, I get really, really frustrated. Anyway, I'm gonna make my lunch, which is going to be yogurt peanut butter powder cinnamon and i'm gonna use that for as a dip for apples and i eat two honey crisp apples and that usually keeps me pretty full uh for a while and it's really low in calories and points if you are trying to eat healthy but after that i haven't told them this but we're gonna go to the park and um to the store last week I took them to the store by myself and I had never done that before <laughs> with the whole pandemic and then and having the convenience of my grandmother just being able to watch them. It was really easy for me to just go pick up groceries on my own for 
a very long time and I finally got the courage to do it. I don't know what made me do it, but I was just like, you know what, let's just do it. And they did so well that now I'm like really um, encouraged and what am I trying to say? I'm trying to say a specific word, but it's not coming to my head. I feel confident, there it is. Uh, I feel a lot more confident taking them out on my own now that I've done it and it went really, went really well. Um, so I wanna do it more often because I think they really do go stir crazy being in the same place all the time. And I do too. So after I eat, we're gonna load up and go to the park. We're gonna go to the store and probably the car wash. So it's gonna be like a whole day out. And I hope it goes as well as it did last time. I locked ourselves out of the car for a minute because I put my purse in with all the groceries and then I closed the back door and I thought it was locked but luckily the driver the driver door was not so oh, we're going to the car wash now the new one. yeah the one with all the colors huh yeah yeah I don't like those so this is like a weekly a weekly thing we've been doing just to like have something to go do. We pick up groceries and we go get the car washed. <laughs> some leftover pork chops and broccoli. Bill usually gets home like around 7.30. Depends on how his day went. And the boys are playing outside. So yesterday I had my yearly checkup um, lady doctor situation and it really has me thinking a lot about the future of our family. <laughs> If you know me personally, then, and, and maybe, I don't know if I've said it on this or not, but I have always wanted four kids. Perfect situation is two boys, two girls. Because then everybody has a brother, everybody has a sister, and like you just, it's like well-rounded. So I went to the doctor yesterday and she asked like, you know, if we were planning on having any more kids and I basically told her it changes day to day. Like one day I'll be like, no, I think I'm good. And the next day I'll be like, maybe one more. So I'm very on the fence about it. And I know it's not even anything I can 
like ask for advice on because it has to be a decision Bill and I make together and that we're really confident in. If I'm gonna do it at all, I want them close together. I'm not sitting here trying to like hint at anything. I'm not pregnant. I can't imagine Emerson getting like older than two and then starting all over with the whole baby stage again. Once I reach that, after having three kids, I'm gonna be done. Like I'm just, I'm gonna wanna move on and start doing more fun things with the kids. I mean, when you have a baby, your life is completely dictated by their sleep schedule, their feeding schedule, and yeah, I don't think I could delve back into that after I've gotten out of it. I specifically remember having like a very similar vlog conversation before I was pregnant with Liam and it was like the next month I was pregnant with Liam. It's so backwards of the two years, two plus years that it took us to get pregnant the first time because after that, as soon as I was able to get pregnant or was trying to get pregnant, I get pregnant like first or second month. Super fertile over here now. All that being said, I have not decided if we will have a fourth. I think Bill is definitely on board now. Like when we first had Emerson and the few months following that, he was like, yeah, let's be done. Let's, let's be done. But slowly he's kind of like, well, no, let's, it, let's just do it. Let's just get the fourth one. Let's, you know, as soon as possible, let's go. Let's do this. He's like, really? Are we sure? Is there a big, is there a big, tell me, if you have four kids or more, tell me if there's a huge difference between three and four kids because I hear mixed reviews. I hear like once you have three kids, like it's all the same after that. It's not any harder. The crazy is the same. So like once you reach three, like that's your peak chaos of life. Like adding more doesn't really do anything, which to me doesn't make sense but that doesn't mean it's not true. So tell me in the comments, like the, late, the, the, the level of crazy, the level of work, the, lev the level of exhaustion, please let me know. I'm not asking for advice, I'm just, I'm just curious on other people's experience. So I totally forgot to turn this burner on. Go me, almost done with this. Not boiling. Looks like it could rain right now. Look how gray the clouds are. Yeah. It's gonna rain hard. Think it's gonna rain hard? Yeah. 